Hey, what's up guys? Daniel here, and I just saw on Facebook, that's just where I saw it, the Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee trailer just came out. I have not watched it yet. Well, I watched the first one second, and I was like, wait, I want to film my reaction. So, um, I've been waiting for this for a while. I'm super curious about this. I saw like some snapshot that almost looked like Pokemon Go on steroids or something. I don't know what this is. I'm confused now. It says Switch right here. The, what? I'm so con Okay, let's just watch it. I just I just want to watch this and give my like um immediate reaction to it or thoughts or whatever. Okay. So there's Pokemon Go. Okay. What the hell? <laughs> If it's nothing like that, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> okay. Oh my eye. What the heck? I'm severely confused already. longer than I expected. Um, I don't even, what? Let me gather myself for a second here. Okay, um, initial thoughts. I'm definitely hyped about the game. I'm super excited. The The thing that kind of threw me off while I was watching it, that it was kind of a letdown, was, I don't know if I saw this right, but, um, and I'm kind of mixed on it. It looks like when you run into a Pokemon, it's kind of like Pokemon Go, where you don't actually have to battle uh, the Pokemon to get it, like, low health to capture it. So that's kind of weird. However, seeing that there is still battles in it in some way, shape, or form might make up for that a little bit. Um, I also... It also looked like that... Like, you see the Pokemon walking around before you actually, like, go up to them which is a mechanic I've wanted in the games for, like, a long time. Oh, man, I'm, like, so... Like, I'm definitely gonna like the game. It 
seems like for sure, especially if it's a Kanto remake. There's just so many emotions going through my mind. This is so weird. Um, like, it's like, in a way, I kind of like that they're doing so much Pokemon Go integration, especially because I'm still into it. But in a way, I feel like that they're kind of, it looks like a little bit much, maybe? But it also looks like it could be really fun, and I kind of like the motion control idea. Oh man, I'm so mixed on this right now. Um... Okay, so so yeah, it's a, I, I heard before that they thought it was going to be a Kanto remake, and um, it looks like it is, and they also showed something where you could like team up, it looks like you can almost like partner up with a friend, and it showed like two people throwing a ball at the screen at the same time, I, same time. I need to watch this again, because they showed the two people doing it, and now I'm confused, because I just like skimmed it for a second when I paused the video earlier, but I need to watch this again. This Okay, I just rewatched it, and I'm actually more excited this time than I was the first time. The first time I was, like, excited, confused, and kind of let down, but also really happy. Bunch of mixed emotions, like I said. But, uh, I do like how the graphics, um, are majorly updated, which makes sense because it's on Switch. I was kind of hoping for something a little more realistic than that. I'm a little bit, not sick of, but kind of just, like, I just feel like that they could have made it a little bit more real but I do like how it's updated and I gotta say I'm so hyped to play um a Pokemon game on like a you know on a, on a like TV instead of like a handheld I'm really excited about that because I don't even play handhelds that much um just occasionally but I'm excited about that um it looks like that um I didn't I missed this the first time around like because I, I was like watching it and I was like so hung up on little things I was like missing full other things that I saw but um they had like the uh it seems like they're putting, like, a big emphasis on co-op, and that's really, really cool, um, because just, like, you know, thinking about playing this with, like, my girlfriend or something, that, that would be super fun, um, and it's cool, because I feel like that, um, it's gonna help you get, like, more of an attachment to your, like, Pokemon and Pokemon Go, um, I'm kind of confused, maybe I missed something about, like, can you, like, transfer every Pokemon you catch in Pokemon Go to your game, and vice versa? I feel like that'd make things almost too easy, I don't think you can do that. Kind of confused about that, I'd need to watch it a third time, I guess. And another thing I missed is I was spacing out at the end, I missed Mewtwo. So that's interesting, I wonder if that's how you're gonna be able to catch Mewtwo officially in Pokemon Go by finding him in this game. Because, to the best of my knowledge, they haven't released him yet, I think they did, yeah, they've done Mew. Um, so that's also interesting. Uh, I still hope that they have, like, battling and weakening Pokemon. Maybe it's just not shown very much. I don't know. That's kind of throwing me off. But I don't know. Like, like, the more I think about it, the more stoked I am. Because, like, honestly, the last few Pokemon games, when I think about it, I haven't even thought were, like, well, the last couple, I haven't even thought were, like, that good. Like, I liked Y, and I got Pokemon Sun, and I I like the um, the Pokemon designs and all that, but it just the the formula just feels really stale, kind of. Um, and I just feel like that, like not like stale, but it just seems like that they uh, just they just need to update it a little bit. And it seems like they are doing a lot of that. So even if it's not exactly what I want, I can't be too unhappy about it because it looks pretty good other than the whole not weakening the Pokemon thing. I'm just being, uh, you know, overly critical. Anyways, that was a lot to take in and a lot to say. And I was mumbling kind of like an idiot there for, for a bit. But um, I also, the last thing I'm going to say before I uh, go here is it's cool because my girlfriend's favorite Pokemon is Eevee and mine is Raichu. And I know it's Eevee and Pikachu, but I still think that's kind of cool. She's going to freak out that she can get her own Pokemon game with her favorite Pokemon on the cover. Um... I also missed, um, I still have the video up here, I look, someone mentioned that you might be able to take any Pokemon you want and have it follow you, I don't know if it showed that, I'm trying to scroll around and see if I can see, it looks like, I don't know, you might be able, I only see Pikachu and Eevee following them, maybe I missed something, anyways, I hope you can do that too, um, it was like some leak or something and it said like a few things that uh, you should be able to do in the game, but Pretty sure that probably would be true because it was right about a lot of things. So, okay. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this reaction video, 
Uh, please subscribe and show support for the channel. I'd appreciate that. Um, I got some pretty cool things coming up that I'm really excited about that I've been working really hard on. So uh, thanks again. And tell me what your thoughts are in the comments below. Are you hyped for this? Are you sad that they're doing too much Pokemon Go integration? Or in your opinion, are they doing too much? I don't know. Either way, just tell me. See you later.